Okay, uh, this is a quick tutorial that how you can bring all the normals, metallic and roughness from Death Studio into um, Character Creator 4. So I'm going to use this transformer in order to get the best out of it. So yeah, that's that. So first of all, uh, I'm using uh, Novak Revisited 8.1 uh, from uh, Faber Inc. It's a very, very, very high resolution and very detailed model. So I just had to reduce a little bit of, um, uh, you know, subdivision from two to one in order to, you know, doesn't get lag or any kind of uh, problems on FPS. So yeah. Uh, first of all, you need to do is need to go to the surface um, and you pick any one of it, go browser and just uh, copy this. I already did that so that you don't have to. So you definitely need this one on a later date. So just go export and um, I uh, already did Exile Novak. Uh, uh, these are my uh, configurations, just the usual thing nothing more just accept and just import it so what i'm going to show you right now is that uh, how it looks like with the standard uh, cc3 plus uh, transform uh, you're going to get the idea what i'm trying to say so yeah let's let it load we have to go to the advanced because in basic you're not getting the uh, proper maps or the morphs that we needed so yeah I had some clothes before in that model, so I'm not going to import that. That's another chapter. And I usually go for 4K because usually it goes with the hero uh, model. Like, you know, uh, the first uh, main model on, uh, in a storytelling. So, yeah. And then after that, when you do that and just press OK. This is going to um, bake the textures so that we can use on 63, uh, 64. Uh, for the um, UV maps and other trinkets. I'm gonna have to, uh, I'm going to skip this part so that uh, you don't just sit out of boredom. So yeah, there you go. Okay, we're back. As you can see, if I zoom in, this looks kind of shit, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let me go to the details pan. Uh, if you go to the body, there are no bumps, no roughness, no way or no nothing. That is not a surprise as you don't get those. Uh, that is why this tutorial has been made. Now, okay, so remember I told you to keep these things up so that uh, we can use it later on. I, uh, this process is quite easy. If you follow up, this is not going to be a problem. So you're going to do the same thing. I'm going to import my model again. Go advanced. Removing all the clothes. Go 4K. But this time we are going to make a profile. Uh, this is a generating a profile for this uh, for this model. So I already have a profile exiled Novak. So I won't be uh, using the. Uh, I'm not gonna make a new one. I'm going to use that. But what I did, let me show you that. After you made a profile, you will get something like that. I opened this with a Notepad. Uh, I'm not a uh, Notepad Plus. Um, so here are the things that you need to keep in mind. Arms, as you can see, Genesis male arms. There are like uh, Novak, um, normal and this. So in order to get that, you need to press view on Windows 10. Go to your file name extension. And now you can see it's JPEG. So what I did, just right click, or you can do F2, just Control A, C, copy it and just you paste it over there for the roughness as well and there are the other stuff like um, arms uh, your ear um, then um, face and torso and leg and etc then you just save it okay 
So I'm not going to uh, generate a new profile. As I said before, I'm going to use this one. Um, Exalt, no back. And you have to do one more thing. Uh, this one, just copy it. Go to your texture folder, paste it. That's all you need to do. Now you just have to sit back and let it load. I'm going to skip this part so that you don't have to wait. So there you go. Okay, it took a while, pretty well, I'm not going to lie. As you can see, there is a drastic changes already in, the, in this model. Um, let me show you the tab. Before that, let's go. Yeah. It's head. You can see you're getting the uh, normal. And also the roughness as well as on the other parts of the body. So it's a game changer. You're getting your nails and, you know, nails normals and even on your um, eyelashes as well. So yeah, um, that's a drastic change. You don't need to go for, if you don't have any skin gen, you don't have to, uh, because you're getting a very good result already by importing your uh, purchased or, you know, free or wherever you got your Dash Studio model. Uh, you can get a very good result now uh, after this tutorial or maybe some people already figured it out how to use it so that's fine um, what I do um, I just um, um, change the eye like uh, these eyes are not good I'm still working on how to get a good eye for the studio models but this will do for now also um, uh, if you need to do a better add eye effect, you'll get a better one. It's a built-in, I guess. Yeah, see, it's much better right now. Also, um, um, the teeth. I don't like this fear teeth. Just re replace it. You're good to go. So yeah. Uh, let us test, um, uh, let, let him wear some clothes, he look very weird with this. <laughs> okay, um, shirt, yeah, this will do. Um, and pant, I guess. Mm. Yeah, cool. Yeah, what a shoe. Yeah, give me a mushroom red one, would look good on it. Yeah, and we'll borrow a hair from uh, whatever I have in the CC4. Yeah, um, I got this one. Sure, why not? Yeah. Yeah, if you want to um, calculate collision, you can do that. So I doubt you need it. So yeah, let's put up animation on him to so, uh, check up if everything is going all right or not. Uh, let's go for a walk. Yeah, pretty nice, right? And yeah, you don't have to do much over here. Everything is fine. Um, let's put up spice on it, like uh, like um. A proper lighting, maybe. That will do. Um, this one. Oh yeah, this one was good. I want cinematic working over here. So yeah, so that's all you need to do. You just uh, need to um, um, re uh, put uh, put those um, normals and all those names over here by uh, you know. Uh, via file extension name that is very important if it's a jpeg or, or png or tif doesn't really matter you just need to have those names or extensions in order to do that and you just save it you need notepad notepad plus i'm using at least notepad plus i don't need anything else and that's all i hope uh, this helped some of you people out there also, if you have low on VRAM, I would suggest that you just lower the scale or resolution of your um, 
textures. Like I have 4K right now, you can go for 2K or even 1080. If it's not a hero uh, character, even a background secondary character, you can just uh, lower it down to 2K or even less. Up to you to your taste and um, you know scene. So yeah, this is World of Zen and thank you for watching the tutorial. If you need anything else to know what you need to know, I will try my best to get some time out and make another tutorial for you. So yeah, that's all. <laughs>